Assalamu alaikum dear students I am Qolana Deem and I welcome you all to the integrated studies lesson of class 3 Our topic for today is natural human and capital resources So let's begin with the objectives first By the end of this lesson you all will be able to learn about resources and its types Dear students listen carefully Resources are the materials that are used to produce goods and services. You must be thinking what are goods and services? Let me tell you. The things or objects that can be made, sold or purchased are the goods, such as clothes, cars, toys and all the things that we use in our daily life. Whereas if we talk about service, it is basically a task that a person does for others. such as teaching sewing nursing or treatment by a doctor these are some of the examples of services and remember that the availability of resources greatly affects a region's economy now i'll tell you about the three different types of resources which includes natural resources human resources and the last one is capital resources now i'll explain them one by one in detail So let's begin with the natural resources. Natural resources are found in the natural environment in the form of raw materials such as water, air, trees, minerals, etc. Few of them are considered valuable as they contribute to the economic prosperity of a region. Now for your better understanding I would be sharing few examples with you regarding the natural resources. So let's look at it. oil gas coal forest gold metals diamond stones and minerals these are some of the natural resources you might be familiar with so now let's move to the second type of resource that is human resource human resources are people who have the knowledge and the skills to produce and sell the goods and services these are basically the people with specialized education and skills who are capable of converting the unusable natural resources into something usable let's have a look at its examples which includes doctors engineers teachers farmers builders and painters etc So all these people who are professionals with the specialized education and skills are the examples of human resources. Now let's move to the third type of resource that is capital resources. My dear students, these are man-made and they can be used as materials to make other goods. Capital resources help in increasing the productivity. Now let's have a look at the examples of capital resources. Tools, buildings, money, machinery and vehicles are some of the capital resources which are required to start a business. Now it's wrap up time. In today's lesson students you have learned about the resources, goods and services. And then we talked about the three different types of resources along with the examples that's all for today now i'll be telling you about your home task for today you have to attempt this question which is define the following terms and give any two examples of each natural resources human resources and capital resources i hope you all will be able to attempt this question after watching this video tutorial thank you for your attention Take care Allah Hafiz